Here's a quick overview and tutorial of my ribbon and outline set. This set comes with 12 brushes and I've added three bonus brushes that I'm very excited to show you today how I would use them. If you don't have this uh, set yet, make sure to check out the description below. I will have a link for my website and Etsy store if you would like to have a look. If you don't know or would like to learn how to download these brushes, I've also added a link in the description below with a tutorial on how to do so. So without further ado, I'm going to quickly show you how I would use these brushes, but of course that the possibilities are endless. It really depends. It's really up to you and your creativity. So I'm going to start with the ribbon standard brush. I'm going to draw a letter. And the goal of a ribbon effect is to have light strokes in the front where the light is and have darker strokes where, where you will have a shadow. So now that you have your letter, you will add a new um, layer and click on Clipping Mask. Now you're going to select a darker color and use the pen brush, which also comes with this set to create the shadows. So this stroke over here will be darker because you will have a shadow, this one lighter because it's in front of the light, this one darker, lighter, darker. So how are we going to create that? So you're going to draw and do the same over here where you have your shadow. Lighter stroke, this bit will be darker. This one will be lighter. So And there you go, we had a couple of simple steps. We've created this ribbon effect. Of course, if you'll take your time, it will be a little bit better. This is just to show you how this works. But you can also repeat this brush by using the noise brush. This brush is in your standard Procreate library to create the shadows. So with the standard brush, this is how you create a ribbon effect. I've also added a duo version of this brush. So the meaning is you don't need to go through the dark and the shadows. You, with one stroke, you will select a doctor, um, darker color and this brush is pressure sensitive. So when you apply pressure, the stroke will change to a lighter color. Let me quickly show you what I mean. So no pressure, dark, start applying pressure. It's gonna have like a light green and release and apply pressure. Let me do it again. And there you go. With one brush and one stroke, you've created this uh, ribbon effect. The next brush is the vintage version of the previous brush. This brush has a nice texture to it. So as you can see, it has a nice texture. And you can repeat the process that I've showed you previously to create the shadows. Or there's also a duo version of this brush. You don't apply pressure, you start applying pressure, you release the pressure, apply pressure, and there you go. You have your dark and light strokes. Another brush that is in this set is called the Stitches brush. So once you're done with your lettering and you would like to add a little bit more to it, you can use this brush and create stitches like this. So as you can see, you have stitch stitches on your letter. The next brush is the outline ribbon. Let me show you. What this brush does is it will create a, an outline of your ribbon. 
So this brush, the inside is transparent. You don't have any color. So if you want, you can um, select a completely different color, drag and drop to fill the inside. You have the thick version and you will also have the thin version. The only thing about this kind of brushes is if you want to have this clear cut inside, please don't uh, lift your pencil because otherwise it's going to create those strokes. But if you do a continuous stroke, it will erase the inside. But if you want to, you can go with the eraser and clean those strokes. The next brush is the Mono, the Outline Monoline. So it's a um, version of my previous ver of my previous brush, but instead of doing that ribbon effect, it will create a monoline effect. So let me show you. And you have also the thin version. This is quite cool to create those retro effects if you would like to do so. And since you know that I love gold, I decided to create a gold version of this outline brush. So this brush, you can easily create a gold effect, a gold outline. And this brush works very well with darker colors. Again, these outline brushes are transparent in the inside. So if you would like, so if you'd like, you can color and see it's transparent in the inside. Next is the another outline brush, but this one will add a shadow. So the inside will be colored with your color of choice and it will create this light shadow. You also have the thin version of this brush. It has created a light and small outline. And my bonus brushes are brushes that will help you create an actual ribbon. So this brush is very technical, it's very cool to use and fun. So you will have an horizontal brush and a vertical brush. The horizontal brush, of course, is to draw horizontal ribbons. So it works like this. And then with the technical pen, with, you will close the gaps like this. And it will give you some guidance with the back and front if you want, or if you just want one color, just erase the strokes, open the path and drag the color and it will color your ribbon. And of course, there's also the vertical version of this brush. And with the pen, you will come and close the gaps or you can actually draw a ribbon if you want. Adjust. Like this. And if you would like to have only one color, just delete the strokes over here. and drag the color. Or you can also use these guidelines to better see where you have the lighter strokes and the darker strokes. And that's it for this tutorial. I'll quickly show you how I would use these brushes. Of course, that the possibilities are endless. A link again will be in the description below if you would like to check this product. However, if you're not quite sure yet, make sure to check the sample of this product. A link will be provided in the description as well. And if you decided to give it a go, make sure to tag me on social. I would love to see where, what you come up with. Happy creations and see you soon.